This is a test, supercalifragilisticexpialidocious. This is a test, supercalifragilisticexpialidocious. Testing. This is a test, supercalifragilisticexpialidocious. Testing. Greetings heroes, I'm Hercules0070 and today we're reviewing two audio recorders. If you have any questions, go your comments down below. Hit that thumbs up and subscribe if you haven't already. Don't forget to hit the bell icon to get notified because I also live stream on this channel. So we have two different types of audio recorders. Uh, one is the Efster and the other one is the Omigo, Om Omogo. I'm pretty sure I destroyed those names. I do apologize, but thank you so much for being patient with me. I had to create a holder for it because both of them uh, had a lot of noise when you handheld them. So I took a old pop filter that um, was for outdoors for a shotgun microphone and I used some rubber bands and a microphone holder that's actually for a handheld microphone but I just removed the metal clip in the middle and slid them between the rubber bands that I uh, put on the hooks across it. This seems to work well and have good audio quality and this way you don't hear my hand sliding around on the buttons or across the uh, metal on both of these recorders. So we have two budget 
options. I say budget because a lot of the other options on the market that are of close to quality of these um, are over $100. So they both are in a budget point of view. The Epster is $54.49 right now with 8 gigs of internal memory, a 500 uh, milliamp battery, and a USB, a micro USB for the cable. And both of them are, have non-removable batteries. The Amogo has a 32 gig uh, internal memory with a USB type C charging cable, and they uh, both have the 500 uh, milliamp battery. Uh, both of them also have microphone input um, and headphone um, output so you can listen to the audio while you're recording, which is really nice. Um, the weird thing for me was that the more expensive one has less internal memory and uses a USB micro USB cable. Um, and the lower price one has 32 gigs internal memory and has a USB-C. I prefer USB-C as most of the things that I own now use USB-C cable, USB cable so it's easier for me to find cables to pop it on the charger or to transfer data to my computer. But I like the audio that comes from the Esther. In my personal opinion, the Esther has a, a low end, more low end sound, which I think sounds better with my voice personally when I listen to it. Um, I also like the way it sounds when I am picking up background noise. So when I record public places or footsteps or cars driving by, things like that, when I was listening to it, I like that lower end on those. Uh, the Amogo has more of the high end on the audio when I listen to it. Uh, the Omogo has a smaller form factor though, so I do like having that smaller form factor, like where it's thimmer, slimmer, but the microphones are um, on the corners of each, the top two corners, they just have like a grill that the microphone's in. On the Evster, I feel like it has more uh, space for the microphones, so it's probably why it has more of the low end on it, I, just my opinion. I don't know for sure why. So, I don't think you can go wrong with either one of these microphones. Um, it just depends on your preference, to be honest with this. I would say if you purchase either one of these, you won't be disappointed for the price. The price is very good on both of these. If you want something to just get the job done, and you're not like really picky, you just are like, I need a recorder that I can throw into the pocket with a lav lavalier that's going to get the job done, Go with the Umogo, you'll be completely happy with it. If you're like a little more picky on your audio quality, go with the Evster. I don't think it'll be a big difference in the internal memory. The audio doesn't take up a lot of space, and 8 gigs will give you plenty. Um, as long as you are able to get back to a computer and download your stuff for each project you work on, I think you'll be more than fine with either one of these in the memory size. You can use these uh, for listening to music, so you can take... Uh, mp3s or other audio files and put them into these and use the headphone jack and make them to the little mp3 players which I think is really cool too so if you um, are athletic and you don't want to have to strap on your phablet to your arm or your pocket and let's say you even have bluetooth it's kind of scary sometimes leaving your phone somewhere or not that's not in your pocket to have the bluetooth headphones in so this way you can like leave your phone and your wallet and all that stuff all in your car and just bring one of these little um, mp3 players I guess you can call it because um, it's also a recorder but you can just take that and you can put that into a small foam arm phone arm strap and throw it out on your arm and you're not gonna feel it because they weigh nothing um, but they're very good they're very high quality in their build they're both made out of metal they both are very sturdy feeling I definitely would feel that these are gonna last you a long time so if you're looking for a budget voice recorder, these don't feel budget at all. They're super, they feel super high end, but they don't cost high end. I definitely say please check these out. Amazon link down in the description to go to uh, each one of these and hit that bell icon. What are you doing? Get notified every time I go live, every single time. 
hit the bell icon, make sure you hit all, because I live stream on Nintendo Switch games and PC games, and if there's a specific game you want me to play, comment it down below. Thank you so much for coming and watching, I truly appreciate it, that's why I call you guys my heroes, and I hope to see you soon. Bye-bye.